Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you are new, my name is Allison. But if you're a returning subscriber or someone who's clicked on my videos, given me a thumbs up, left me a lovely comment, welcome back. I'm so glad to have you here. Um, but if you are new and you haven't subscribed, down below are my buttons. You can push a couple of them and you can subscribe to my channel, hit that bell, and then you'll know when I upload because I don't have a schedule. I just upload when I can. So if you hit that bell, then you'll know when I put a new video up. See, it all works out well. We're all happy. It's all good. So quick note, this video is just going to be called Let's Hang Out because that's all we can do right now is hang out, you know, watch some YouTube, read a book, do some work from home if you're lucky enough to be able to do that. We're all in this together. Let's try to always remember that. To all the medical staff, the grocers out there, the pharmacists, people that are out there working just to keep our world going and to keep us safe and healthy, thank you so much for doing that. You are greatly appreciated. You're much loved and I wish you all the best health and safety. And I wish that for everyone who watches my channel, whether you like me, don't like me, thumbs up, thumbs down. I only wish you the best and I want you to be safe and healthy and let's get through this together. Quick note, if you have grandparents, family, neighbors that are a little older, elderly, why don't you check in on them? Make sure they're okay. Make sure they don't need anything. In this time of the world, why don't we come together instead of trying to tear each other apart and be kind and generous and show what we are like as a country and not the greedy part that we are being shown in the media. I know we're better than that. I know we can come together and be better than that. So let's do that. Let's care for each other. And that's all I'll say. Quick note about my Patreon page. I'm having some stuff, let's just say that, going on in my life where right now it wouldn't be prudent for me to start a Patreon page like I had talked about. Um, I have been advised not to do it and I'm gonna take that advice because I'm paying them, so I'm gonna take their advice. I talked to them about this channel. I showed them what I'm doing on this channel. They're not happy about what I do on this channel, but since it's already out there, I can't really take it back. Um, I mean, I could privatize all my videos, but somebody could have made copy, you know, you just can't. So I can keep going with what I'm doing, but anything else more is not under advisement for me. So I'm gonna take that advisement that I'm paying for and I'm gonna roll with it. I don't know how long this is gonna last. I don't know how long um, this is gonna take. It could take a day, doubtful. It could take months, it could take a year. I don't know. Right now with the way the world's going, nothing is going quickly. So I'll say this for you. If the only reason you're on my channel is you're hoping for a Patreon page where you can see more of me, um, quote unquote, even though I haven't said more is more or what more might be, you can always unsubscribe from me. You know, you're not paying for this. You're not paying for anything that you're seeing on YouTube here. So if you're not happy with my content or me, you can unsubscribe. I would hate to lose any one of you, but if you don't feel comfortable with me anymore and you don't like that I don't have a Patreon page for you guys, I understand. Find somebody else who you jive better with. But if you want to stay, I'd love to have you here. I appreciate all of you being here. So, blah, let's get on with the fashion show. Oh, since we're not being to go out thrifting right now, I'm running out of clothes to show you guys. So, there may be some repeats in the future, depending on how long this kind of forced enclosement is going on. I don't know. Let's see. I've talked too much. Let's go on with the outfits. Here we go. Outfits. Now is the very first one. This is actually a robe. You guys know I love robes. I think robes can be very sexy. Um, I've tied this one up. I'm wearing it with a red thong because I had somebody in my last video I think or the video before that asked me to wear red panties so I can't remember who asked me that but if it was you this is for you I will wear my red thongs for you today so this is just again a nice kind of spring floral robe I saw it I thought you know what this could be cute this could be sexy 
This part was shorter here, so I thought I would just tie it up. Gives a good amount of cleavage here. You could, you know, go a little bit. I say, don't want to expose myself because that really, I know you guys wouldn't mind it, but you know, YouTube, not so much. But um, yeah, it can give a little bit of sexiness with a shoulder being off like that. I'll turn my stuff around like that. But yeah, I think it's pretty cute. I think it's comfortable. It didn't come with a tie, but that's okay. You can always make your own tie with this or leave it open like I am doing right now. And then you would have a nice little sexy look. So I thought I'd come up just a little bit closer So, because sometimes you guys think I'm a little bit too far away. I'm working on that with my phone to try to make it look like I'm a little closer. But yeah, I think she's pretty cute. Again, I like the little cleavage in the middle. I love these even with shirts. I like the little cleavage, just enough to be kind of cute and sexy. I don't know, what do you guys think? Yes, no, would you turn somebody away who was wearing this or would you like them? You tell me. Okay, well, let's go on with the next one. Here is the next one. Now, these are supposed to be up on your shoulders and blah, 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 blah. I don't think that's sexy enough. I think anytime that you can get more of a off the shoulder look with your outfit, I think it's sexier. I think it's cuter. This is again, another like spring looking um, nightgown, lingerie, however you wanna put it. But again, we're getting more off the shoulders and I just think that looks sexier. You're getting a little bit of side boob, a little bit on each side, just a little bit, not a lot, but just enough where it's kind of cute, kind of sexy. I don't know. It's polyester, I'm 100% sure, but it still feels nice and sexy and smooth up against your body. Makes you feel good. I love that feeling up against me. So let me do my lovely turn. Someday I will perfect it and not look like an awkward dork doing it. But you guys seem to like the awkwardness. So yeah, I just wanna like mess with it and cause it just feels so soft and good against your skin. So again, this is more of a spring looking one, but I'm wanting spring. It's supposed to be here. So there you go. All right guys, so here is another closer look. Again, it's supposed to be on the shoulders, but I think you and I both agree. It looks better when it's falling off the shoulders than up on the shoulders. So. I like it and I like this, you know, baby blue um, light color also. I think it's really pretty. I think it's very spring-like. I like it quite a bit. So hopefully you guys like it too. All right, well, let's go on with the next. Here's another one. This is just like a crocheted knitted top. This was actually from Old Navy, but the best part is this is supposed to be a small petite. I don't, this is just, I'm talking to the few women who are watching this go look at other clothes in the thrifting world. Don't just stay in your size. Go to smalls, go to whatever size that you want because you will find clothes in every size that may fit you. Okay, back to the clothes because the guys don't care about that story. But yeah, this is just a nice crochet top. Crochet is supposed to be in for the spring. So I saw it and I thought, well, I can be in for the spring and also have a cute little outfit to wear for you guys. So yeah, you know, it's supposed to be on the shoulders and all that, but what fun is that? We like the off the shoulder look. So uh, let me do my lovely awkward turnaround. But yeah, she is cute. She's almost long enough to wear as a dress, you know, for her small petite size. So not quite, not quite but it's giving you some good leg to the side, you know? So, and I don't know, I think it's cute. I think it's comfortable, that's for sure. So those are a couple standards that I love, cute and comfortable, but you guys can tell me what you think. Of course it's crocheted, so it's got little holes, so it's see-through, but yeah, I think she's cute. I will definitely wear her out. All right, here is the closer look. Yeah. I think she's cute. I think she's comfortable and I would definitely wear this. I might wear it with like a bralette or something underneath it if I go out into public, but for you guys, I like it. All right, let's go. I think we have one more. Sure. 
This is my Black Sabbath t-shirt. Um, if you don't know who Black Sabbath is, then look them up. Um, but yeah, this is supposed to be a muscle shirt for guys, I guess. I don't know. But I had forgotten I even had this shirt. And I was like going through my clothes trying to find ones that would fit. So I'd have some more clothes for you guys. And lo and behold, I found her. Isn't she gorgeous? So uh, let me take a step back. You know, she's just a t-shirt, you know, so nothing too exciting there. I mean, I'll do a turnaround, but yeah, not really that exciting in a turnaround. It's just mostly that it's a muscle shirt and it's got this opening right here. And yeah, she is pretty cute, I have to say. Hopefully you guys will like my Black Sabbath shirt and you'll appreciate the fact that I put her into our video. I think she's pretty cute. Why should guys get to wear all the muscle shirts? Us women should wear a muscle shirt once in a while, even when you have no muscles. Yeah. So hopefully you guys like this one. All right, guys, that is it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the show just a little bit. Hopefully it'll entertain you for a few minutes and you'll forget your troubles. And that's all I really want to do. I want to entertain you guys, let you guys have some kind of relief from this world that's gotten a little chaotic and just enjoy yourself. That's just the point of these videos. Um, and hopefully I did that for at least one or two of you. Okay. Um, hopefully I'm going to get this up today. Today is Saturday. So hopefully this will be out later on this evening and you guys can watch it and enjoy it. And I want you guys to have a safe weekend, take care of yourselves and have a good week. Hopefully I have enough, I think, to get out at least one, maybe two more videos before I might have to do some repeats. We'll see. Um, maybe in another week we'll be able to do a little bit more. I don't know. We all don't know. The world's a little crazy right now. So we just take it day by day and we get through it. So again, I love having you guys here. Um, and I can't wait to uh, hear your comments and uh, get out another video to you guys. So until then, be safe and I'll see you soon. Mwah.